Today we're going to try something a little different. Um, this right here is called adobo. This is Spanish seasoning. Um, you can find that in um, you can find it in most supermarkets. Um, if not, uh, you might have to go to a specialty supermarket if you don't have. But most most supermarkets definitely carry Spanish seasoning. Uh, so we're going to use a tablespoon of adobo in here. And now remember. Um, just start lightly with your spices. Don't put a ton of it in in the beginning because remember you cannot take them out. So add a little bit of spice, taste it, you know, as it goes on. Let it cook for a little bit, let it seep in, then taste. If you need more spice, then add more spice. Now we're going to try some sazon. And sazon is another Spanish seasoning. They come in packets. Once again, you can find it in most supermarkets. Um, th these two packets roughly equal a tablespoon. So we're going to use this table, tablespoon of sason in here. We'll just spread that about. Sason is a great spice. Um, I, I use sason in a lot of a lot of my dishes. So I would definitely want uh, want you to go out and experiment with some sason. Now back to uh, some uh, spices you've heard of. Of course, garlic powder. So we're going to put a tablespoon of garlic powder in here. We're going to put two tablespoons of oregano in. A tablespoon of black pepper. And a tablespoon of salt. And we're going to mix this in. And this is simmering nicely. And you see how it's cooking? The, the vegetables are getting soft because they're cooking nicely. And the meat is cooking nicely, and the juice, you see the juice here? That's the best part, I'm telling you. Wait till you taste the juice. Okay, now we're going to add some wine. 